today's episode of Fast Talk, let's take a look at GVL's collaboration with Mobile Suit Gundam. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Fast Talk, the faster than usual, where I talk about fast food, talking faster about it. And G is one of my favorite drinks. I always like when they do these collaborations with either video games like Spiral or Pac-Man, Sonic, stuff like that, or into uh, other like niche games like Super Meat Boy or uh, Brain Drive or even weird like shows that have a cultural relevance. Like, they did some Marvel stuff, and then they did Mobile Suit Gundam. Which feels like, oh, okay, they're, they're, they're catering to the gamer weeb nerd crowd. Cool, that's, it's like, a, what, what, what's the graph? It's got the circles that overlap with each other. The G Fuel has one of those somewhere. They're like, where can we overlap here and there? Uh, but this flavor was interesting. I don't know if I like the, the flavor name. It's MSM310N. I don't know what that's meaning. Oh. It's a melon flavor because it's melon remu, and I just got it as recording this. <sighs> that's dumb. That's funny, but that's also dumb. Uh, clear reference to the RX78 2, the, the first Gundam, whatever. Funny. I. That's that's stupid, uh, but I like most of Gundam. It's, you know, it's I have some of the the, uh, the figures from Gundam Universe. It's something I like uh, figure wise. I don't watch any of it. I haven't played any of the games or anything, uh, but it still does intrigue me. So let's go ahead and try this because the melon flavor really intrigues me as well. All right, better look at the packaging. I overall really do like this one. It is a taller box. I'll get into that here in a second. Um, I like you got the mobile suit and the pilot, and then you got the suit there. And then another look at the, the box there. Um, I overall really do like it. Oh, I have that figure somewhere. So the main reason why this is a taller box is because this specific um, tub comes with a... Uh, metal shake the taller tall boy shakers which i really like this here's the thing i like this a lot this i could use uh for more everyday uses like if the take to work with water in there stuff like that really really dope uh you know you got the gundam there uh then you got one of the the, the, the villain gundams there and all that it's really cool i really do like that a lot that's neat and then you get you know the tub which is gonna have the gundam on there again it's gonna have the side art and all of that or oh, really do like that a lot there is a ingredients list there i'm going to take a look at go right ahead and there's a sticker that's really cool i'll have to put that somewhere some of you are probably wondering how do you mix the shakers let's see the tall boys i'm gonna recommend uh check out electric shocks video it's gonna pop up here it's also gonna be down in the description of uh, the video along with all my social media links, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all of that down below, where he explains expertly how to properly uh, mix these. I watched it to, in preparation for this video, so please go watch his because he explains it way better than I can. <laughs> all right, smell test. We got. A very powdered smell, but that usually doesn't uh, dictate the flavor. It just, you know, sometimes they just have a powdered smell. Sage wood had a powdered smell, but a very good flavor. So, huh. That's not awful. I like that. Um, I'm not a big fan of like a lot of melon flavor. Well, just because here in America, um, we have a lot of like it's watermelon, very candied watermelon. But Ram Yoon, I like because the melon. Is it, it, it's not watermelon, but when you see, I think melon, I think watermelon is very much more your cantaloupes and whatever the green one is, that one, uh, that, that, whatever that is, is very much more of those flavors that overall really do like. It's very subdued, very simple, but still very good. Overall, I really do like this flavor. It is probably one of my favorite jugal flavors, I think. Uh, it's at least in my top 10. 
And once I get through a lot of, I got some G Fuel ketchup reviews to do. Uh, I'll probably do a uh, top 10 G Fuel flavors so far of the ones that I've tried and reviewed. But G Fuel's always coming with new flavors, so it's really hard to do that. Uh, but what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Do you guys like this? Do you not know what Lowe's are going to miss? Um, another video I'm going to recommend is from Toy Galaxy. It has a whole video on um, Gundam Wing how it, when it came over to America. I'm going to recommend that video. It's a really fun video that he did. Check it out here. Uh, and also, you could again, check out me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all of that down below. Links are in the description, along with uh, a few of questions that you think about the public shakers, how to shake them, and all that junk. Electric shock down below, uh, definitely worth watching. And again, if you can leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, uh, all of that, and check out my Juvel playlist playing up here. I know that's a lot, and I'm keep up with the mic, I'm sorry. Uh, hope you guys do all of that things. And uh, guys, have a good rest of your day. Stay bearded, stay faithful, peace. Do you feel worse at uh, Minecraft Damia flavor? Come on, go.